Say hello to the 15 million Durham watch collection. So this is a weird way to start today's vlog, but today my sister just painted a new painting. Like, what? Guys, in, in case you don't know, my sister's a really good painter, but she rarely ever does a new painting, so I was like, yo, I need to see this. And yeah, right now my sister's bringing her brand new painting downstairs. Oh, it's there. You need to go back so I can like turn it. Yo! That's me! How long did that take? Three hours. Three hours? Guys, I swear, if I was my sister, I'd be painting every day. Yo! Guys, it's a million dollar note. Like, it wasn't perfect because I only had three hours to do it. So. Guys, my sister did this in three hours. We're now worth a million dollars. Yeah, now you can put this in your room for future Bro, it headquarters. Looks, it looks really good. I just wanna say, I just made my first million dollar check. <laughs> yeah, listen, if you think my sister's talented, smash the like button. Honestly, I think she needs to keep doing paintings. Like, she's so good at it. If you guys buy my paintings, that would be good funding for me to continue, I mean. Can't just do something and live a free life, bro. Who's gonna pay the bill? If you're good at something, never do it for free. That's an amazing way to start the day. Smash the like button. All right, good job, Donna. Good job. Thank you so much. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Woo! Yo! Alright guys, today is a special day. To start out the day, it's early morning, I just got out the house and I'm here with my boy Ahmed. Ahmed! What's up, what's up, guys? We woke up too early today. Here's the thing, I haven't dropped merchandise in like forever. The last time I dropped proper merch was probably two years ago when I dropped the mall vlog t-shirts. I mean, I've dropped some merch here and there, but today, you're back the bed. Your boy is back in business, guys. Yes, sir. Yes. You know, he has to take a little break to get that solid design. I needed the ideas flow. Exactly, guys. You wanted something unique, something you haven't seen before. Not some MV logo on a t shirt. This some. This is right, the yeah, bucket. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This time I sat thinking of like an idea that I've never seen before. Something that's just funny, cool, that if you see someone wearing, you're gonna like start a conversation. Like, yo, that's a good idea. Mike. This is like my slogan when it comes to life. It's gonna be kind of controversial when you see it. You're probably wondering what it is right now. What is this design we're talking about in three, two, one? So here you go, this is the new Moblogs merchandise and I know a lot of you are probably wondering, yo, what is the meaning behind this merchandise? What's going on over yeah, here, what, man? What's going on? Why does it say I'm broke? You know, I love that, but it's such an awkward place to vlog. I always work as if I'm broke because you never want to get ahead of yourself and think you know everything or you're too good for something. If you want them, go grab them right now. And yeah, I'm probably gonna have them out for like 10 days. So anybody that orders it and wears it and sends me pictures, I'm gonna be posting you all over my story and giving you shout outs, guys, because I want to see everybody repping the merchandise. No. <laughs> Look at my t-shirt. I'm broke. I'm broke, <laughs> I'm broke. Okay. What do you think? Yeah, what do you think? No. No? <laughs> no, no, it's the mentality. Ah. Ah. Yo guys, I love it. She was like, you're not. <laughs> you're not. <laughs> but really, you are. Do you like the t-shirts? Yes, I do like it. I'm broke. <laughs> gang, gang, how are you? You like the t-shirt? Oh, I like it. Give me. I'm broke. <laughs> yeah. Man, I that's can fix it. You can fix it? Yes. Oh. Okay. Oh. Okay. Right, M O. Guys, by the way, I thought they knew the channel. They actually have no idea about my channel. But they still like the same. So, <laughs> to continue off today's video, now that you've seen the new merchandise, I've actually come somewhere very special. Now, you guys know I love expensive watches. So right now, I've actually come over to my friend's watch shop. He owns millions and millions of watches. The watch he has inside is Drake's watch. 
And guys, that watch costs 3 million dirhams. Let's go. So here we are right now with my good friend Father. How are you, my man? Hello. By the way, guys, I just showed him the t-shirt. You're broke. I'm broke. Me too. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, say hello to the 15 million dirham watch collection. collection right here now as I said today I'm gonna to be showing you some really really cool timepieces now inside this box we have some of the world's most limited watches that you are ever going to see and I'm not gonna show you anything regular I want this vlog to just be about stuff you don't normally see guys now for anybody that knows watches, you're probably seeing a lot of timepieces in here, but I'm gonna jump straight into the big boys, guys. Now, now first things first is this, okay? <whistles> guys, wow. So this right here is a Richard Mill 5202. This is one of three in the entire world. Now this watch goes for three million dirhams, approximately $700,000, guys. Guys, now in Dubai, horses are a big thing. So to have a horse on a Richard Mill, it's really a popular one. Honestly, I'm here to see one watch and it's this. This is a watch that Drake owns and it is honestly, it's probably one of the most adult watches out there. Now the reason I'm saying this, this watch costs three million dirhams, which is $700,000 and it always has like a very erotic message on the watch, okay? I'm gonna show you that right now. 30 pieces of them are made in the world. So if you flip. Woo! Guys, as you can see, um, they like eating this. chocolate. Yeah, that's about chocolate. That's nothing else. <laughs> <laughs> Talking about chocolate, exactly. <laughs> So basically, this watch has a really special movement. Every day, it gives you a different message. It's a very grown-up type of watch, but it's a very, very limited piece. It's insane. $700,000 is the price. And this beauty, just engraved here, 20 piece limited. Guys, yeah, look at this. Wow, it's heavy. Oh my goodness. So this is made out of platinum, not even gold or like silver. 140,000 retail price, and you can't even get it for that price, which is just crazy. This is actually a really, really really limited piece as well so this has hindi numerals on it it's an ap watch automatic spaghetti one of 30 in the world and if you guys can see it's very very unique i've never seen numbers like this before like whoa once upon a time used to be like 140,000 us dollar nowadays it's 300,000 us dollar wow. more or less yeah. guys since this watch came out it's doubled in price Okay, now just to let you know, this box right here, there's 15 million dirhams worth of watches. And we're still adding some more watches in there, so let's make it. 15 million and counting. Guys, so this is one of the thinnest pieces that AP has. You can really see like how half. thin the watch is. It's like, it's like the half. half it's half of, of a regular watch. That t-shirt, bro. <laughs> what is that t-shirt, bro? Work as if you're broke. So you always work really hard then. <laughs> yeah. We're back home right now. Today has been a fun day. We checked out some very cool watches. Mm -hmm. But guys, I'm back home and we just received this. I'm pretty sure I know what it is, but we're gonna go ahead and open it up, okay? Guys, I think I know. <laughs> oh, oh, Yeezys! Yeezys. Oh. It's been a really long time since I actually got myself some Yeezys. Okay, open it. Okay, open it, open it, open it. Alright. Ta da! <gasps> oh, damn. Wow. I've never seen these ones before, bro. Pink and neon orange on the back. Wait, do these glow? Bro, I don't know, but these are like pink Yeezys. Do they glow? Bro, you know how it's supposed to make them glow, right? Yeah, you're supposed to charge them up, right? Yo, guys. Okay, we're gonna check if they glow. Wait. Can see I, I don't know if you can see me. We're gonna test if these are glow in the dark right now. I think so. they do. 
No. <laughs> These are some really cool shoes I just got. Um, yeah, shout out to nobody because nobody sent me these. I bought them. <laughs> that rent life. <laughs> Too bad now you don't have the pink Aventador. You could have taken a nice photo. I mean, they're not really pink pink. They're like a beige. Oh yeah, they're not pink. They're orange. I swear to God, I thought it was pink. Now I think it's orange. Actually, this is a good challenge. In the comment section, is it orange or pink? Let us hmm. know, guys. Hmm. Today has been a crazy enough day. But to end of the day, I'm about to go and do something I never thought I would do, okay? I'm going to color my hair pink. No! It's a color that I always like. Don't judge me, don't even, don't, don't judge me, okay? Just don't judge me. But guys, I was like, yo, since my hair is like white, why not try and make it Barbie pink. It's about to happen. We're gonna make my hair pink. All right, let's go All right guys, so right now I just made it over to the salon and We are about to change the color of my hair guys like my hair is about to transform from blonde to bright pink <laughs> So right now we have my man Fidel. He's about to make me go from this to pink so yeah. Guys, my teeth are the same color as the sink, so the dentist did a good job. The best part about this is when you first bleach your hair, you actually need to burn it, but because my hair is already like white, it literally just feels like a head massage right now. So it's like, you don't feel any sort of like burning or anything. Honestly, anything you do inside a hair salon is like so relaxing. This is like ASMR right now. Whoa! So this is the first layer. Now, it's gonna go pink. So right now, the hair is just finished. And are you ready? Okay, drum roll please. Ta-da! Oh, I have pink hair! My hair is pink! This looks so good right now. Never would I think that pink hair would actually suit me. Wow. No, bro. When did that happen, bro? Is that, can I touch it? Is that real? That is awesome. I want to do that, bro. My hair is pink. I'm back home. I'm going to end up today. Is this permanent? This is permanent. <laughs> I mean, I mean, it's gonna wash out in like a few days, guys. <laughs> Bro, this is like really different, yo. What made you decide to do this? I'm confused. I don't know. Today has been an amazing day. I hope you enjoyed the vlog. I'm back home. <laughs> Bro, you know, you look so funny. You know why? Why? Like, you literally look like you have a, a pink pot on your head. Let me show the people. Turn around, turn around slowly. Like, legit, look at that. <laughs> It doesn't blend in. You're black here and then you pick. Right? Hi guys, anyways, we're gonna wrap up today's vlog here. If you haven't enjoyed, smash the like button. My hair is pink. And you, you act like you don't want it. Why did you choose it then, bro? I don't know. I just thought it looked cool, but maybe I didn't know. Yeah. Alright guys, I love you. I'll see y'all tomorrow. Like the video, subscribe, and if you want to look like me, don't. Just don't do it. It's a feminine watch. Yeah. I think he was drunk that yeah. day. He wore his wife watch. So. <laughs>